Do the World Christmas Event Part 1 is finally out. Well, it's not really a Christmas event, but two Christmas tins have been added to the game already. Next week is a big Christmas update, but this week we've got two tins. And you can get free 500 gems just by doing one simple task. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and let's get into the massive update. There is a new awakening for Craggle Day. Here is what it looks like. It's got a massive fur coat, it looks like. That one is a mist tint, but it's pretty much just brown and white. Still an earth melee type, and it's got really good attack and speed stats. And this thing can also hit levitated doodles. That is its unique trait. Now, to get this new awakening, you must get a jolly tint. This is a brand new tint, one in 250 chance on any doodle in the wild. Here is the color scheme for the jolly tint, pretty cool. And the second tint is called the frost tint, which is my personal favorite. It is a blue and cyan tint, and it can be found in the wild. Of 1 in 250 chance as well. You can't boost these odds, it's just a straight 1 in 250 of each tint. And to get Crackle Day A, you must hand in a jolly tint to the NPC at the social park and they'll give you the Crackle Day Awakening. After the Christmas event ends, the Crackle Day Awakening will be added to the Runic Island, so you don't have to rush now to get this all done. But let's go to the social park and get our free 500 gems, as well as some other cool rewards. Okay, this new NPC should be just around here somewhere. Okay, I found them. It's on the beach area, so you go across like the subway train car. Talk to this person right here. Show me a doodle with a unique tint and I'll give you their color. So they give you colors for the tints basically. I've got to go get tints. So you get colors for each tint. It won't work for regular tints, just for exclusive ones like the Easter one, the Halloween one, the Christmas ones. All of those will apply. So I've got to try and find all the tints I've got. I've got a fried tint. Surely the fried tint works as well. I've actually got to use my tin brushes to get the new tint colors. So I'm Mr. Print Minalitra. You're now a Halloween tint. My Christmas this one will go on my Incinalisk. I just ruined the black Incinalisk. No. I've only got one July tint brush. Oh, well, I guess I'll still use it. It's whatever. Okay, so I've got the Pride tint, the Easter tint, Roulette tint, July tint, Christmas tint, and Halloween tint. I've still got more tints to use, so we'll see if Pride tint works first. And it looks like Pride tint does not work because we've already got the Pride color from the event, so makes sense. Let's get the Easter tint one. There we go, it's a 2023 color. The Glimu, which is the roulette tint. And we got the roulette color. I think the roulette animated works as well. Let me just check which of these notes. Okay, so it works for Easter, Sunset, Halloween, Jolly, Frost, July, Roulette, Animated Roulette, and that is it. So I don't even think Christmas works. Christmas does not even work, and I just wasted it on an Incinalisk. Does July work? Joy July works. Okay, we've got the July color. That's good. That was my only July tint. And the Halloween one does not work. So the new Halloween one does work. So I have to go hunt for that one. I do have a sunset tint. So let's get the sunset tint one out. But you guys can do this with any tint that works. Okay, I got a sunset color just then. Let's have a look at all these colors. So here is the roulette tint. It's just basically just a roulette tint. Here's the sunset one. Pretty clean. July one. Yeah, that's cool. Easter one. This one actually is not too bad. I like the Easter one. You mainly use these on the doodles with these tints and that is all of them this npc will give you craggle day a if you hand in a jolly tint and it must be the jolly tint you can't have the frost tint if you do that you'll get the awakening okay now how do you get 500 big gems well we've got to talk to an npc in the social park area and that will give you 500 gems for just being in the doodle world group to join the group you must go to the doodle world page where the doodle world game is on roblox scroll down to the developer section and click the developer section and after that you just gotta join the group actually i lied they're not in social park they're actually the mystery rewards npc at the crossroads area from the crossroads you gotta make your way to graphite lodge and at the graphite lodge station you'll find the mystery rewards npc that'll give you 500 gems if you were in the group you'll get 500 gems just like that if you've got a shop right here these are the new skins that just got added so we've got the harbinger spirayu skin flood local is also new as well as knight nianto and good and evil finwick there's all the new skins and that is everything new in the doodle world part one update of the christmas event subscribe for more updates and i'll see you guys later goodbye